I know you want to be a master manipulator just like Johann Liebert. If you want to gain more power, I will give you the blueprint you need. By the end of this video, I've taught you every little detail you need to know in order to become the person you truly want to be and to rule over your own reality. The first step to become the ultimate manipulator is to master emotional manipulation. Emotions are the strongest feelings a human can have, and therefore it's perfect to attack there. It's a game of light and shadows played within the human psyche. You must understand how emotions drive human behavior, understand the basic fears and needs that drive people. The need for love, safety, security, and the fear of loss, embarrassment, or failure are the first starting points for you. Pay attention to people's voice and body language to understand how someone operates. Oftentimes the truth is not in what people say, but how they say it. So pay close attention to this. Understand their desires and fears and use this knowledge to your advantage. People are more likely to be influenced when they like and trust you. Build rapport by mirroring their body language show empathy and make them feel understood. Once you understand someone's emotional triggers, use them to your advantage. Instill fear, uncertainty or doubt if you want to control them, or give comfort and validation if you need to gain trust. Control the narrative by framing situations in a way that aligns with your goals. In the theater of life, the histrionic manipulator is both the director and the star. This is a realm where drama reigns supreme, and emotions are not mere feelings, but sharpened tools for influencing others. That's why we will use the powerful tool of drama for ourselves. Picture yourself on this stage where every word, every gesture is a carefully crafted performance to captivate and control. Your life is a constant performance, each scene more compelling than the last. You don't just express emotions, you amplify them to extremes. Every interaction is an opportunity to showcase your flair, to draw others into your narrative. You are a master of emotional exaggeration now, capable of turning mundane moments into scenes of drama. Like a moth to the light, you're drawn to the spotlight. You crave attention, not merely as a desire, but as a necessity. Your presence must be known, your voice heard, and your influence felt. In the eyes of others is where you draw your power. You possess a unique charm and allure that's hard to resist. Your words and emotions are infectious, your passion undeniable. People will be drawn to you. They find themselves empathizing, sympathizing, entranced by your display of raw emotion. In your world, relationships are about dependence. You're not just a friend, lover, or someone unimportant. You're an addiction people get drawn into your drama and offer help in any form to be the hero in your narrative. At this point, you already have a huge power of other people. They love the emotional roller coaster you poverty and start to crave the highs and lows. The constant excitement that comes with being a part of your life and they will do anything to stay with you. At this point, you've absolutely mastered the emotional human part. So it's time to bring passive aggressive ploys into play to make sure you stay on top of the game. Master the technique of undermining others through seemingly innocent actions. Make small, almost imperceptible moves that disrupt or derail others' plans while maintaining a facade of innocence. Missed deadlines, forget crucial tasks, or misinterpret instructions, all while maintaining a facade of cooperation. Harness the power of silence and omission and refuse to give direct answers or essential information. Communicate in half-truths or non-committal responses so you can create an aura of uncertainty around you, leaving others off balance and unsure of your true intentions. Make statements that seem benign or even flattering on the surface, but carry a hidden insult. With this method, you can plant seeds of doubt or insecurity, so you have the best requirements to make them think and operate like you wish. Utilize the tactic of playing dumb when it serves your purpose. Pretend not to understand clear instructions so you can evade responsibility. Position yourself as a victim or martyr whenever convenient. Exaggerate your efforts and downplay your successes to gain sympathy. This tactic will often make your opponents or targets feel guilty, allowing you to manipulate them more easily. Now picture a figure shrouded in the guise of perpetual suffering, a master of evoking sympathy and compassion for their gain. This character is akin to an artist painting themselves as the underdog because he knows everyone always loves the underdog. Yet beneath this facade lies a manipulator's heart. This manipulator, the martyr, is adept at spinning tales of misfortune. 
they're always the victim, the one wronged by the world, the one bearing burdens too heavy for any soul. Their stories are compelling a tapestry of trials and tribulations designed to target the heartstrings. The martyr's power lies in their ability to make others feel a burning need to help, to save, to uplift. They prey on the kindness and empathy of those around them, twisting these virtues into chains of guilt and obligation. In every interaction, the martyr positions themselves as the one wronged the on, in need of support and understanding. They are masters at deflecting blame, always finding a way to be the victim even in situations of their own making. They make others feel like by helping them, they do a noble, righteous deed. But this is no mere cry for help. It's a calculated strategy. The martyr is not seeking solutions, he is seeking control. Every act of assistance, every gesture of support, binds the helper closer to them, creating a cycle of dependency where the helper feels increasingly responsible for the martyr's well-being. That's why you should always remember that no matter the situation, sometimes the one who seems the weakest hold the most power. But all of this is just your start into the complex mastery of human manipulation. Subscribe to our channel so you don't miss the next lesson.